Th thank you, Mr. Chairman. Uh, thank you, Madam Secretary. Uh, this reform, the ATC reform, is an infrastructure proposal that uh, you know, I can certainly explain to the constituents that I talk to, so I appreciate your leadership on this issue, appreciate the chairman's uh, uh, leadership as well. Getting, it's getting government out of the way to make flying more modern, uh, quicker, and with less carbon emissions. Uh, I can also easily explain the benefits to the economy. It's, it's helping the U.S. catch up with what our competitors are doing across the world. What I don't want to do is go home and say that Congress stood in the way of, uh, of an important reform like this. That'd be a much harder one for me to explain. Uh, I do have um, the two questions I had essentially were asked by the last two uh, panelists as well, or members as well. Um, I have the district that I represent includes parts of three different counties, each with their own smaller airport, but very important to the commercial operations into the economy in each of those areas. Two of those counties have uh, contract towers. So I'm uh, as interested, uh, to, as has just been brought up, very, very interested in ensuring that uh, what we're doing here does not uh, negatively impact contract towers. And I think you've just uh, answered that, and I'm satisfied with that answer. One of the airports, uh, Chester County Airport, does not have a tower currently and is in the process of uh, asking for, wants to build a, a tower there. So I guess for, for, the, um, for a county, for an airport that wants to build a new tower, do you see any, do you, th you think this proposal compared to what we have now would uh, help them to accomplish that or would this provide some this impediment? This proposal is basically airspace. Mm -hmm. So I think new asset, you know, something on the ground would, be, would not be handled by this. Yeah, you, but you said this proposal would potentially help uh, existing contract towers because they're often the first ones to be cut. Yes. So for the establishment of new one, do you think it had the same impact? Uh, that would, is a good question. Right. So I, I'll have to get an answer for you on that. Yeah, and again, um, the issue of access to rural areas is, is uh, one that is important in my each of those counties as well. I think you've answered that, but I just want to uh, emphasize as well that uh, it, it's very important for us to uh, ensure that that access is available and uh, look forward to continuing to work with you on this proposal. Thank you. Thank you.